Kristen Cruz still here at the LA Baby Show with MomAngelus.com and we're at the Palm Station booth hanging out with Jamie Grumet who just flew in from Uganda and I'm not even kidding. Like She's been all over the world. She's got this new travel show coming out that she's doing but she is here to and, she, and by the way she's doing amazing work all over the world. Thank you so much for what you do. Oh thank you for having me. Oh, Gosh this is so welcome. fun. Yeah. Absolutely. Now you know Jamie is a big supporter of breastfeeding, which is why we're here at the pump station booth. So let's talk to that a little bit. It's so important to you. I think normalizing breastfeeding is really important to me. I wouldn't say I, I want everybody to breastfeed or that's something I'm advocating for, but um, normalizing it in our culture is extremely important to me. There is a difference to that, right? It's Yeah, it is a conversation that we want to be able to have. It's, an, it's a, a comfort level that we still don't have yet in our culture, and we're so advanced. That's that's strange that we're not there yet. It's really weird, and it's it's not just breastfeeding, but that's one way that you can see a healthy parenting style being stigmatized, where they have like this one way to parent, and they want all of us to parent that way. And if we don't, then we're we're ostracized a little bit. And so that's really, I think, with breastfeeding just happened. I fell into that being something that everybody knows before. So I just kind of focused on that one issue. And as a mom, how can we support other moms? How can we help this initiative in a way in our own communities? Um, seeing if they need anything, also letting them know no matter what they decide to choose or they can and cannot do something physically, that you're there for them and you're going to be supporting them at 100% whatever they choose to do, whether it's not breastfeeding their baby at all or breastfeeding their baby until they're five or six like I was breastfed. Yeah, or, or I breastfed my kids until they were four. So yeah. Yeah. so it's important that to understand we're all different and we all just need to, I mean, there's so much mom judging going on, so many so much haterness happening. It's just, it's important that we all pull together and just support each other no matter what. It's really the deal. Um, Jamie, I have to say, I, I need to ask you a little bit about traveling all over the world with your new travel show. I know you're going around the world going, doing good deeds. Can you tell us anything more, like a scoop on the show? Um, okay, so we just went to Uganda, and I just got back from there, and they gave me scarification there. That yeah, it's still healing. Um, where uh, it's not necessarily something specific to Uganda, but there just happened to be two experts that are Ugandan that are there, and so they decided to basically drill holes in my arm. <laughs> we did that really hurt, I'm assuming? I mean, it was okay. My co-host Joel Lambert is a former Navy SEAL and uh, they actually took a razor and just started cutting him like this. And so I'm watching him thinking like, I have to like really prove myself because I'm the little female with, you know, trying to smash the patriarchy a yeah. little bit. Yeah. And so they go in and I'm sitting there like this, I can't feel this at all. <laughs> this, is, this is fun. Yeah, so it's been, yeah, a lot of uh, white water rafting the Nile. And now we're gonna go be sleeping in ice caves that we're digging ourselves in the Laplands of uh, Sweden in a month in the middle of an Arctic winter so it's not easy travel but it's 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 fun yeah, I mean as a host I thought I might always want to do a travel show now no no that's not happening I need hotels and things like that no scarification um so while you're out you are doing good you're bringing some philanthropy why don't you talk to that a little bit because I don't really know that that aspect of it. and I think a lot of shows don't do that um, yeah, so we just happen to, I already work with a lot of nonprofits, so it kind of just organically happens. Right now, uh, in Uganda, there was this vi ch children's village where this mom is a nutritionist, really into breastfeeding, and um, we were able to connect her with a bunch of people who could um, potentially help fund some of the children in the orphanage, um, yeah, where they're teaching, and it's, it's great. But I also work with Waves for Water a lot, which um, is at Eric Garcetti, the mayor who we just met, his dad works with them as well, so I, Eric's dad, yeah, so they've they've been connected in a weird way too, so there's a lot of, it's funny, the philanthropic things in the baby world actually have been merging lately, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah which is cool. Yeah. Thank you so much for giving a voice to moms, the way you've always supported us. Thank you for being here with the Pump Station and supporting LA Baby Show, first time in LA. This has been such a huge weekend, it's been so much fun, right? So fun, thank you so much for being here.